Review. I'm your host, Jamie Lynn, and each week I'll be reviewing some of my favorite reviews from Google Local Guides, the sweet and savvy people who help you decide where to go on Google Maps. Now, you know a review on Google Maps comes from a local guide because it looks like this. It's pretty nice, right? This week, we're heading to a world of pure imagination, the candy store. A one-stop shop for confectionery bliss that's been satisfying people's sweet tooths for generations. Whether you prefer chocolate-coated, sugar-spun, sour-sprinkled, yummy gummy, there is simply no denying that the candy store has something for everyone. This week, I scoured Google Maps for the sweetest local guide reviews, filled with sugar and spice and everything nice. <sighs> Michelle from New York writes, This place has been around here longer than your grandma. And I've heard stories about your grandma. Get you and your grandma's life together and get you some deep fried Oreos from Ray's. Well, my grandma passed away 15 years ago. And from the looks of it, this candy store is still up and running. So take that, Grandma B. Grandma loved Oreos and jokes, so I'm pretty sure she's in heaven loving this five-star review. Great Scott! RSA traveled back in time at this Vancouver candy store. You will be regressed magically to your childhood when you see, buy, and eat the candy you used to have when you were a little bambino. Who needs time machines when you can time travel via candy? Hey, uh, Grandma B, meet me in Vancouver, okay? Yeah, like four o'clock. Joan was treated to a super sweet and sort of surreal experience in Paris. She wrote, George, the owner and lover of people, regaled us with the story of his childhood dream of opening a candy store and creating an amazing store for children and adults. He also shared that he cannot eat sweets but derives joy from sharing with others. Ugh, sounds like a real life Willy Wonka. You know what, forget five stars. Joan scored the golden ticket, hmm? When in Rome, local guide Kenny accidentally stumbled upon this chocolate shop where the staff only spoke Italian. The girl who worked there helped me pronounce some of her favorite gelatos, and it made the experience great. Hey, Kenny, you know what? You may not speak Italian, but it sounds like you are fluent in chocolate. <laughs> you and me both, buddy. Audrey had me wanting to go to Montreal after reading her descriptive review. You must try a marshmallow bear. They are the most delicious and soft little things with a dollop of creamy and wonderful chocolate. <sighs> Honestly, Audrey, those bears sound almost too good to eat. Maybe I'll just buy one as a pet and name her Beatrice after my grandmother and have her be my little chocolate friend. Or maybe I'll just eat her. Who knows? Well. Clearly everyone agrees that candy is delish, and everyone also agrees that there is no sweeter thing than earning the local guide trophy for the review of the week. Thomas was lured to a Chicago candy store by the sweet siren song and left the store completely transformed. I was drawn to the store through the huge window display of delectable treats calling my name. Once inside, I was a little kid in a candy store, hopping from display to display, wondering what to get. In the end, I settled for a peppermint ice cream cone and a seat at one of the very few tables inside. I sat down, devoured my cone, and went back in time, imagining a simpler life full of treats and sunshine. This is a great local business to support on Broadway. Wow. This is the uh, second time we have traveled back in time via candy today. What is in those candies, local guides? Hmm. Well, as a good friend of mine once said, life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. Huh. Well, thanks to these local guides, I think we do know where huh, we can get some pretty sweet candy. Well, thanks for watching. And ooh, be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And come back next week and let us know in the comments hmm, what reviews you want us to review next. Oh, and in the meantime, good luck with that sugar high. It's gonna be a rough crash. Whew.